Nicki Minaj has broken many stereotypes. Being one of the few female MCs to hit the mainstream in such a powerful way, Nicki has learned to ride the spotlight. Speaking of writing, we've also noticed she's an expert grinder. And though she does a great job on her own, Nikki really shines when another person is thrown into the mix, which is why we are here today. Here are seven very lucky individuals who've had the pleasure of being grinded on by the one, the only, Nicki Minaj. Let's get started. First, we have Drake. Nikki and Drake are longtime pals. They're practically siblings. So the grinding that happens between these two is pretty much platonic at this point. It's not romantic, just, you know, some good old fashioned grinding between pals. And Drake has the distinct honor of being grinded on by Nikki, not once, but twice. The first time it happened was in 2013 in Drake's hometown of Toronto, Canada, while Nikki was touring. She brought him up on stage, and well, that's when the magic happened. Happened. The second time occurred during Nikki's Anaconda video, and well, we'll just let that do the talking for us. I just gotta give a slow clap for that because damn. Next up at number two, we have Justin Bieber. We cannot forget about that one. We couldn't get enough of their collab, Beauty and a Beat, when it was released back in 2012, but then this happened. The world collectively cringed, and they didn't care if that made us uncomfortable or not because they recreated that moment during the American Music Awards that same year. Moving on to number three, we have Lil Wayne. Similar to Drake, this is a strictly platonic business-related grind. During the 2013 Billboard Music Awards, Nicki performed high school and was joined by Lil Wayne, and what kind of performance would it be had she not gotten her grind on? Facial expressions that Lil Wayne makes right before it all goes down are priceless. You should definitely rewind and check it out one more time. Now, Steve Nash, AKA the number four fella on our list, actually has a couple things in common with Drake. Number one, they're both Canadian. Number two, Nicki Minaj grinded on him on stage while she was performing a concert. Yes, the basketball player got a very friendly welcome from Nicki when she got frisky with him on stage in Phoenix back in 2011. Man, Drake, Bieber, Steve Nash. Does Nicki secretly have a fetish for grinding on Canadian guys? Next up at number five, we have Big Sean. So these two collabed on the Smash single, Dance Ass, back in 2011. And what would a song about ass be without a little gyrating? And to think that just a few years later, Nicki would collab with Big Sean's gal pal, Ariana Grande. It is a small world after all, you guys. Moving along to number six, we have Busta Rhymes. In 2013, these two joined forces for a song called Twerk It, and spoiler alert, Nicki twerks it on Busta. For number seven, the final spot on our list, we have B.O.B. And again, this is an open and shut case of Nicki grinding on one of her coworkers. These two teamed up for the single Out of My Mind back in 2012. And you know it wouldn't have been complete without just a little bit of grinding. Just another day at the office. There you have it, Barb's seven guys who Nikki has grinded on. Which ride was your favorite, and who do you think enjoyed it most? Tweet me at Miriam Issa, comment below, and then click right over here to get a breakdown of the best booty songs of all time. And don't forget to subscribe as well. I'm your girl, Miriam Issa. Thank you so much for hanging out with us here at Clever, and see you around.